finally, the day arrived, and it was our first test at Silverstone after all the preparation. And it was time to go to work. And this is how it turned out. I checked the forecast the night before and I knew there was going to be some rain but what we got I wasn't expecting. I remember looking out the window and looking at the conditions, they were treacherous. I was driving in weather that I was hoping we weren't going to have when we got to the track. Yeah, I knew it was going to be a tough one. It was also my first time in the car since February, so having to adapt to the car conditions in one day was going to be really hard. But yeah, I was looking forward to it and I was confident I could prevail. You know, all kind of different thoughts were going through my head, whether the test would go ahead and, um, and you know, what the conditions would be like. Once Brandon suited up and he was fitted for the car, you were just waiting for, it was like a horn to sound. I mean, literally a horn, that was what they used. You, you heard a horn sound and it was the fact that your session was about to begin. And um, last minute preparations, I had to, you know, I, although, you know, I'm a dad in the background and stuff like, I still like to make sure that all the um, safety issues and the things are, are dealt with, you know, I, um, like to double check on his seat belt and like to double check that his, his, you know, his gloves, his boots, his hands device for his neck is fitted properly and um, just to reassure myself as well and um, you know then I have to step back and leave him in the hands of the team. <laughs> 